Guys, my cat Carmen wants to know if you like her pillow that literally has a picture of her on it. Hit that like button down below in five seconds to let her know you like her pillow. She would really appreciate it. All right, guys, welcome back to another Fortnite video. And in this one, we have so much fun stuff to talk about. We're going to be going over 10 secrets and leaks in the new update of Fortnite that you didn't know. I've put together some of the most hidden Easter eggs, hidden things in the files. We're even talking about like a mythic weapon coming up soon, as well as a ton of other other stuff that can be found on the map and as you guys know this is sort of like a game as well so when you're watching this video keep track of how many of these secrets you know and then at the end of the video compare it to this list right here then leave a comment below the video of what rank you got so you can compare with others and see how well you did but yeah with that being said hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so that you know right when a video like this comes out you definitely do not want to miss the ones coming up but yeah guys without further ado let's go ahead and jump on into it all right guys Let's go ahead and hop into it here with the first secret I want to show you and for this we're just going to hop into solo So first things first Let's start off with a really interesting one that can be found over at Camp Cod way on the bottom of the map And these first two secrets are actually going to have to do with bosses and then we'll move on to some other stuff So yeah, I got to look around a little bit for this. Uh, oh, there we go Bunker Jonesy is up here. And why is he so weird? Ah, who are you? Why are you talking to Bunker Jonesy? I wanted to talk to Bunker Jonesy. Okay, good. He's running away. But yeah, it's as you can see he says stuff like it's all coming together man don't you see and then you can ask him a question that says what do you mean the loop don't you see it we're all in one big loop you can ask different things like did you hit your head or something a big loop makes sense to me so what does this loop do uh let's say what did this loop do it loops you me time space it all loops i think you've lost your mind sure wait a minute you're not one of them are you oh my gosh guys who is them who is bunker jonesy talking about that is so crazy you guys should check that out because there's even more he can say but I'll leave that up to you guys. Also, as a little bonus, for some reason, this back bling is glitched. Where if you run side to side, it gets really weird. It starts stretching like really far like that. And oh no, we're getting shot. Okay. Now, next up is a very hidden secret. If you go into your locker and you happen to have one of these skins, for example, let's put on Der Burger, save and exit on that. Then head into a solo match. And specifically, we're looking for the Pizza Dude. Tomato Head, I think his name is. If you go inside and talk to Tomato Head as Beef Bob, obviously their rivals and stuff like that he will have unique dialogue like he says he says that what does that even mean tomato head but yeah that's a completely unique piece of dialogue if you're dressed as beef boss now i had tried to do the same thing using tomato head and going to the der burger location but for some reason i couldn't get beef boss to spawn so i don't know if he's like not in the game anymore if you guys know leave a comment down below now next up on the list guys we need to head over to uh what's this location called i'm forgetting the name of it but there's a very important leak that is going to be added in the next update that has to do with this location. Now, this location has so much mysterious stuff about it. We don't really know what the purpose of it is, and there's not a boss or character here at the moment. However, according to Fort Tori, there is in fact going to be a boss added in the very near future. Now, whether or not that is like a actual boss similar to the Mandalorian, or just a normal character boss that you can talk to, we're not 100% sure, but we do know that the file has the name Nightmare. That's also the name of this location itself. Itself. But yeah guys expect that to be added in the next update or so But also with that there is another secret that can be found inside of this location. Oh, yeah, it's called stealthy stronghold. That's right. Oh My gosh, I got him with it. <laughs> come on. Come on. Oh, let's go, guys. That was kind of crazy, but we need to head into replay for this and then head under the map over to the stronghold area. And if you look under here, you will notice that there's a secret building underneath this location. Now, let's see if we can get inside of that. I think if we go up towards this area, so where that tree is, that little corner, also under this smaller area over here. And here we are back at the location. We need to go over to this small building. Then if we go into the corner of it, there you go. You can head inside. And why is it so glitchy? I don't know, but either way, it's one of those secret buildings that you can find around the map. And this one is a lot different than the other two we were able to find in, what was that, our previous video? This time, there are three elevators that go down instead of just the one at each individual spot. So again, guys, what do you think all of this is for? Why is it even here? There's a lot of questions to ask. And you know what? That leads me right into the next secret I want to talk about, which is simply, well, there's actually two secrets that have to do with this logo right here. Now, obviously, 
actually this has a large part to do with the story, I mean why else would it be here? But the first thing that you may notice about it is these symbols that go along the outside. Now we don't know too much about those symbols specifically, but if you take a look at the center, that is very clearly the zero point, or at least a symbolic version of the zero point. Now what's even more interesting about this is that Fort Tory has found out that this symbol is for the imagined order, which is also the same name as the troopers because they're called the IO troopers. And there's actually a description that says elite commando from the imagined order. And they also have similar symbols to this one right here. And actually, if we take a look at it right here, you will see that this symbol on the side is essentially the same one that can be found on the front of their suits. Definitely very intriguing. However, if we go back to the battle pass for our next secret here, you will notice that in the background, there is that same exact symbol. So to recap all of that together, that symbol is for the imagined order, which is also in connection with the IO troopers. But since it's in the battle pass, does that mean that that is the agency that Agent Jonesy is a part of? And also what all of these characters are a part of. Now let's move on here to another leak I want to talk about that has to do with a brand new mythic weapon. And would you guess it? It has to do with our good buddy, the Mandalorian. Hey buddy, I got a present for you. There you go, have fun with that. Now guys, as you notice, when he's firing at us and he's going to break his own ship, he uses a different weapon than the one that he drops. Obviously we know that he drops the sniper, which we will see here in just a second. Oh my goodness, if we can even defeat him here. There we go, we finally got him. But as I was saying, obviously he only drops these two weapons, the Ambin sniper rifle and his jetpack. However, according to leaks, there is files in the game for a mythic item that is his blaster. Also, as a bonus little secret, there's this campfire right here that has a uh, flopper roasting on it, which is so funny if we light it. It's roasting the flopper. Oh, you can also break that for loot? I literally didn't even know that until right now. But yes, the blaster is the same one that he uses. We at least think it's going to be added, or at least that it is in the files as a mythic item. But again, we don't really know why it hasn't dropped quite yet. Next up on the list, guys, let's take a look at, uh, what is it called? Hunter's Haven down here. There are a ton of secrets you need to know about at this location. Also, I find it interesting that you can't really, the buildings aren't on the map here. I wonder why that is. That's just a bonus thing I literally just noticed. But let's go ahead and go down there now. Okay. Yeah, we do have a couple of people here So we got to be a little bit careful, but if we go over to this building, I think we'll be perfectly fine got a blue AR Perfect. Where are these guys firing at? Oh, it's a Peely. Sorry, buddy. You are done for <laughs> Oh, no more IO troops or whatever they're called. Actually, these guys are pretty funny They kind of like let oh, no, they're shooting at me. They usually let you know when people are around. Oh My gosh, they keep coming at me. It's crazy. Oh, there is a person over here. Oh, be careful, be careful. Got him. Let's go. Anyways, the first secret I wanted to show you in this area is if you go down into this building specifically. Hi, how are you? Oh my gosh, that scared me. Okay, but yeah, if you go inside of this building, there's this very interesting device that is being built. And what it seems to be is like a version of the Brute. That's right, guys. The uh, crazy vehicle from way back when. Is it possible that it could be returning in a brand? And new device. Why else would this be here? Why would this robot stuff right here be set up like that? Everything like it. Now again, it could just be a decoration, but it could be a hint towards a brand new vehicle considering that we haven't gotten one this season quite yet. And pretty much every season before, we have in fact gotten a brand new vehicle. Oh my, I did not hear him at all. How did I not hear him? No way, no way, no way. No way! No way! How did I survive that? Oh my gosh, dude. Guys, hit that like button down below. There is no way I should have survived that with two health. <laughs> Anyways, with that being said, let's move on to the next thing, which is kind of overall, all of these buildings have like their own themes that are based around the characters in the battle pass. If you come into this one, you will notice that there's a ton of syrup sitting everywhere. And if you go up the stairs, I think into this room specifically, there's like all of this stuff for making syrup. There's even this 
thing over here with a wanted poster and that is basically in reference to man cake this type of stuff can be found over at his location this restaurant right here so that's very intriguing but if we move over a little bit more i don't remember if there's anything in this building okay yeah there is as you can see there's some of the stuff from the coliseum so this is a reference to menace you've even got all of the spears over here very intriguing very intriguing and then for example if you go into this building and i think go upstairs into the bedroom that's not the bedroom oh okay yeah you can see like this stuff right here these katanas and uh also isn't that jonesy on there i wonder why jonesy's there this is obviously a reference to uh oh my gosh what is that one character's name from the battle pass the ninja type guy and then if we go inside of this area you will see that it's a uh i also don't remember the name of this skin but you can clearly tell that it's the one i'm putting on screen right now <laughs> so yeah pretty much every single section in this has some references to the battle pass skins the other secret that's really really interesting is if you go up here i think to this house up at the very top let's look around a little bit we go inside of here it's possible they might have broken oh no they didn't there is a peely in what is it it's not kryptonite i don't know why i thought it was kryptonite but it's a reference to star wars that one scene where han solo gets put in the stone as we can see peely has unfortunately met the same fate <laughs> which is just a really funny little easter egg not only that you've also got these display things with peely on them instead of jonesy which i found pretty funny but anyways guys that is the final secret of the video so here again is the ranking list be sure to comment down below which rank you got i'm really curious to see how many of these you knew but with that being said remember to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications for more fun videos like this coming up in the near future and on top of that you can check out some of my previous videos such as going over some xp glitches to help you level up incredibly fast check that one out but again i hope you enjoyed today's video and i will see you in the next one